For this class, I'll be using a product of the Wait and Eat Cooker. Where this idea came from is I am a working mother with a daughter, a husband, a job, hobbies, and I like having at least a couple nights a week a nice meal on the table. With working a full day, this isn't always an option. You can only eat so many fast 30-minute meals. One of the solutions is doing crock-pot meals, which are fantastic solutions for moms like me. The problem arises when you set your crock pot at seven in the morning when you leave your house for dinner at six o'clock at night and it only needed six hours to cook. And I, on any given day, will be gone from the house for 10 hours. So some crock pots have a warming setting. So you cook it for six hours and then it warms for four hours and you come home to this burned, weird looking thing that nobody wants to eat and you end up having pizza or McDonald's for dinner and the kids are really happy but you're disappointed that your meal didn't turn out right. So my product that I am creating for this class uh, really is trying to solve this problem. How do I get the food done for dinner time without burning, without leaving it set up to a remote timer where maybe my raw food spoils before it cooks, because those are sort of your options. You can set it up for a delay timer outside of what the crock pot or slow cooker tells you to do with you know a Christmas light delay timer thing. But if you have raw chicken or beef or something in there and it sits for four hours and then cooks, you're really risking foodborne illness. And running home at the middle of the day to start the food isn't really realistic. That's the point of using the crock pot. So the idea I came up with is the wait and eat cooker, kind of a pun on the wait and see. Like, what are we having for dinner, mom? Wait and see. So the idea is, it's refrigerated until the timer says it should start cooking and then it turns into a crock pot. So at seven in the morning, I would turn on the refrigerator part and have it kick on at noon for a six hour high cook for dinner at 6 p.m. And my dinner would work, it wouldn't be burned, we wouldn't have to worry about salmonella or trichinosis or any other foodborne illness, E. coli. We would have a delicious non-burned <laughs> crock pot dinner and my family could have more nutrition than fast meals. So that's my idea for this class and I'll be using it for all of my examples.